Hey everybody, back with a quick recap. Um, a couple football cards and a lot more basketball cards. And I don't know if it's just because there are more basketball cards for sale as the, uh, the NBA playoffs are in full force and football is in the offseason. But uh, I have uh, just a few football cards to, to showcase. I still try to collect on the same players. But like I said, there's just not a, as many of those up on the market right now. But um, I'll show you a couple of them, a couple CSG graded cards, the Marvin Harrison 96 SP, that red background, pretty cool card, then a uh, Charles Woodson rookie from Bowman's Best in 98. I was real excited to pick up this Flair Showcase Champ Bailey, uh, numbered to uh, 1,999. That's a cool card, really sharp card. It's got that refractor finish to it. Really underrated in my opinion. Then uh, not a sports card, but this is a Bridget Bardot autograph uh, on an old playing card. I think uh, I have a um, Sophia Loren autograph also as well. So it's kind of an iconic actress. And then um, a couple basketball cards from the 90s that are uh, SGC graded. I always try to pick these up, these Upper Deck SP uh, rookies with uh, Grant Hill, if I can. And then here's another one. Um, got a few of the Jason kids as well. And then this is my first Bowman's Best uh, rookie for Vince Carter, 98. Now we're on to some PSA-graded slabs uh, for basketball. I call this one the, uh, the Jackie Moon Special. It's actually Randy Denton. Uh, not a bad center in his own right, uh, playing for the... Uh, is it the Nashville Sound or the Memphis Sounds? Excuse me. A center. He yeah, averaged a double double. Uh, then a Hall of Famer, great player, Nate, Nate Tiny Archibald, late in his career playing with the Buffalo Braves. And then uh, some junk wax era Jordans here. 91 upper deck hoops. I like that 97 tops. Kind of reminds me of the 96 Ray Allen tops card. And then. Uh, a 90s great Sean Kemp coming down with uh, the two best players from the 90, 92 draft, Shaq, and then uh, the number two pick, Alonzo Mourning. Then uh, like the one Hall of Famer from the 93 uh, draft, Chris Webber. A couple Ray Allen cards. They were just so cheap. I mean, I've got the many of these cards already, these Fleer Metal and then the finest Ray Allen. But uh, I couldn't pass picking them up for what I got them for. Uh, two of the big highlights from this lot of cards I've picked up in the last couple weeks. This Ultra Star Power Tim Duncan. This is the plus. This is like one every 36 packs you get a plus. So it's, uh, I think there might be 20 of them. It's kind of got a refractor finish. It's kind of the middle grade. There's a higher level you can get on those and a lower level. So it's right in the mid grade. But a really cool card. Picked it up Tim Duncan's rookie year. And then uh, the lights kind of give me a problem. But here this is this Holographics Hall of Fame. Kobe Bryant from 99. I'm a big fan of the Holographics set. That's just a super sweet card there. Uh, I think that inserts one in every 17 packs. So not the hardest, not the easiest. But boy, it has amazing eye appeal and the shine on that. Super cool. So I finally sprung and picked that up. I've had it raw. So I finally got it in a mid nine. Uh, another card, man, got a steal on this is Moses Malone. And he was still being productive even uh, even when this photo was done. That's the 87 Fleer. Then another Kemp rookie from uh, 9091 Skybox. And then a little run of Jordans. You know, I'm picking up Jordans anywhere around. Uh, a little less than 10 bucks a pop on these. The 91-92 hoops. The uh, Fleer, 92-93. You saw this one already. Uh, got it again in the CSG. Then uh, a couple of tops from 92-93. Not his base card in that set, but uh, highlights. And then this 40-point club. I don't know why I bought so many of them. Probably just trying to get one. There's just the market's being flooded with this stuff right now. It's CSG and PSA are sending a lot of stuff back. Here we are, Shaq, rookie. The, uh, the Tops, rookie for Chris Webber. Another Ray Allen rookie. Uh, Low-end collector's choice. And then we'll wrap it up with a couple of Tim Duncan rookies. The, uh, the Fleer Showcase, Flair Showcase, excuse me. Then the base Fleer, and then the base Tops, and the Sun, there we go, the light's kind of playing with me a little bit. And then the last one, a really cool card, this Dirk Nowitzki uh, Molten Metal. That's a really cool card. It 
he doesn't have his uh, number on his uniform yet, but it's a cool card. Anyway, that's uh, that's the recap from some of the stuff I've been picking up. Uh, once again, everyone, I appreciate your posts, comments, and I'll talk to you again soon.